You like the best first the best. Do ya? That's what we're talking about. Right here on the Double RT Boxing Show. I'm your host, Mr. A. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in. I am your host, Mr. A, the Double RT Boxing Show, the Ready Ready Talk Boxing Show. And we are talking the best versus the best in France, the country of France. Number one and number two, super lightweights, getting it on in the fucking square circle. We're talking Frank Petitjean taking on the IBO champion, Mohamed Mamoun. Should be a great fucking fight. The best versus the best in the country of France. Now, challenger Frank, 22 and 4 and 3. Five KOs, one loss, and his three draws. Taken 30 years old, Southpaw. Man, 17% knockout ratio. Taken on the champion, 20 victories, two losses, two KOs. These guys are not hitters. This is going to be a boxing match. You know, I like it. I like Mamoon. Like I said, if you know me, I look at a KO percentage and I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck about it. Because I like the best versus the best. <laughs> That's how everyone says. We want to see best versus the best, man. We want to see the best versus the best, damn it. Well, you have it right here, and no one gives a frat's ass about this fight. Except us right here on the Double RT Boxing Show. I think this is going to be a hell of a fight. The champion comes in at 31 years old, 5'10 with a 70 inch, 71 inch reach. The attributes for the challenger are not listed, but the height is not listed as well. <laughs> But they're both 31, both southpaws, uh, both very pillow-fisted, both on a long winning streak. These guys do not know how to lose. They're not used to it no more. Um, they're both very good defensive fighters. They, they use the ring very well. Um, they slip punches. They fucking duck on punches. They they run away. They go in and out. They're, they're good pull counter punches. Uh, fast hands I believe Frank has the shorter reach so he, he should need to fight inside but like I said he's good with, I think he might have the faster feet to get in and out so he may and yeah I think he has the faster hands so he could probably get in and out with pull counters and uh, just overall counters like I said, that's faster like that just defensively these guys I think are equal with the feet like the the way I'm going to break this fight down, instead of saying what they're good at, the flaws that they do have, that, that might be able to be picked apart. The challenger, he's, like I said, he's a pretty damn good fighter, man. He's good at going backwards. He's good at going forwards fighting. I said, both these, both these fighters are better at going on the back foot countering. Now, if someone was to go forward and has to press the action, I would say they're uh, the better front foot fighter to me is Frank. Frank. You know, Muhammad, Muhammad ain't as good on the front foot. He's a better back foot counter puncher. And Muhammad's flaw is he's about 90% of the time, he's going to escape out to the right. He's going to escape out to the right and check right hook you. So that's that's his bread and butter. So if you can cut him off, you're going to really fuck him up a couple times. It's, you know, he's, he, does, he, does he cut off to the left and check hook you with the left? Yes, but he, he's going to counter you with a check right hook. He's going to escape off the ropes with a check right hook. About 90% of the time. And while Frank, he does a, that little Manny Pacquiao type shit. He'll pump two jabs and then jump in with the third. You know, he'll pump with one jab and then jump in with the, the left hand. You can time his, his rhythm. You know, and besides that, these guys, they, they Frank, like I said, Frank throws a, probably a better punch sort of selection. And he, uh, while Muhammad throws more of one punch at a time, but can he throw combinations? Yes, he do. In the inside game, the shorter arm Frank is going to have the advantage, I believe. He's faster, shorter arm, they get there more. This is... Number one, number two, the best versus the best. IBO champion, Muhammad Mamoun, taking on Frank Petty John. Mr. A, right here on the Double RT Box. Follow the show on Twitter, our, at RTB Show. At our RTB Show. Who in the fuck do I want to pick here, man? Because Muhammad is number six 
in the W. No, he's number five in the WBC. So uh, this is not just uh, a fight just to cover the fight, even though it is the best versus the best in the country of France. This is, like I said, this is what the Double RT Boxing Show is about, folks. This is why you're here, because you like boxing, you like the rankings, you like that other shit. You like boxing talk. That's why you are here. That's why you're about to subscribe. And that's why you're going to give that thumbs up back to the show. Because I gave you one, I bring it back to the show. Best versus the best. Number one, number two. France Super Lightweights champion, Mohamed Mamoun. IBO champion, 140. Taking on challenger Frank Pedijon, and the prediction goes to I'm going to go with the champion. I'm going to go with the counter long reach outside boxing, and that predictable check left hook right hook escape. Pedijon's going to be fast and getting on his ass, but I think he's going to be uh, jumping into some check right hooks and once in a while an escape left hook. But you know, Moon's good. He does a body stab. He does everything. He's he's a good rangy fighter. But I don't see him pressing the action. It's going to be Frank pressing the action, getting counter with some check left hooks and right hooks. The Double RT Boxing Show. Follow the show on Twitter at RRTB Show. If you like what you're talking about, I'm doing some practice runs on some live show. I don't have a set time for the live shows yet. Figuring out other countries' time zones. I'm trying to, trying to get the audience involved on a better time zone. So join me on Twitter at RRTV Show. And I post up about a 20 minute to 15 minute heads up when we're going live. Thank you for your time and support. The best versus the best is discussed right here on the best fucking show, the Double RT Boxing Show. Thumbs up, bring it back, baby.